Let's take a quick look at how to apply drop shadow here in Photoshop. Now there's something called layer styles in Photoshop and these layer styles, you can apply a lot of different effects. One of those effects is drop shadow. So I have a layer that includes this photo right here. If I double click anywhere in the blank space to the right of the layer name, it's gonna pull open the layer style dialog window. Now inside the layer style, you'll find drop shadow. If we check that, it's gonna apply a quick drop shadow. Also, if you select drop shadow here, there's a lot of different options. You can change the blend mode. It starts on multiply. You can change the color of the shadow here, the opacity up and down. You can adjust the angle, which is more apparent when you adjust the distance. So how far away that drop shadow is. Quick tip here, you can see use global light. If you have this checked, then whatever you set the angle will apply to any object or drop shadow in your document if you have this check mark. So you could have all drop shadows with the exact same angle without having to really set the angle. You just set the global light angle. If you do have one drop shadow that you want to do differently, then uncheck this and set its own custom angle. And of course, the distance here as well. Now the spread kind of affects how impactful the shadow is. And then the size is basically the blur of the shadow. So if you bring that all the way down, you'll notice that the shadow is now just a really hard cutoff. Or we can kind of blur that up. We can bring the size size down. It just kind of depends. We can also adjust the quality and the contour as well as the noise of our shadow if you want to add in a little bit of noise. But for the most part, you know, adding little light touches or light drop shadows is pretty easy here in Photoshop just with those layer styles. Now those effects are right here. If you don't see them, there's going to be a little arrow that says effects. So that's basically your layer styles. And you can just double click on drop shadow too go back in and re-edit that drop shadow if you want to or need to. You can also uncheck it to remove it or you can hide it over here with the little eye icon right next to drop shadow. That's how to add drop shadow really quickly and easily here in Photoshop.